Hello and welcome to another episode of Cancer Educational Research Institute. In this video, I'm going to explain how you can do a monthly breast self-examination in three simple steps. Why is a monthly breast self-examination so important? Because with a breast self-examination, you can actually detect breast cancer in an early stage when it is most Curable. And trust me, I have seen and talked with so many breast cancer patients and breast cancer survivors who have detected their breast cancer with their breast self-examination. We actually do have a video in which we have interviewed a breast cancer survivor from Germany who has detected her breast cancer with her own breast self-examination. Without further ado, let's go ahead and let's talk about breast self-examination. As I mentioned, there are three simple steps you can do your breast self-examination. Stand up tall and then put your one hand behind your head and then start gently pressing your breast on the side in which you have raised your arm and put behind your head with the fingers flat. And I will show you in a minute how you will do the examination. Once you're done examining your breast on the right side, switch to the other side and place then the other arm behind your head and then again with the other hand, fingers flat, start to examine the other side, the other breast. Again, I will show you in a minute how we will do the examination. But what you will looking for with this kind of examination is look for any kind of bumps or thickening. I would like you to stand in front of a mirror and then place your hands on your hips and then examine both of your breasts for changes in size, shape and form. Do the same thing with hands raising up above your head and then do the same thing. Check your breasts, both of your breasts, for any kind of changes in shape, size and form. Lie down on your back and then let's say we will examine our right breast. We will put a pillow or a towel underneath our right shoulder. Then we will raise our arm and put it underneath our head and then start with our left hand with fingers flat as we did on step one and then we will start examine the right breast. We will do the exact same thing on the left breast. How we will do that? We switch the pillow or the towel and put it underneath our left shoulder. Then we will raise our left arm and put it underneath our head. And then with our right hand, fingers flat, we will examine, as we did on step one, our breast. So now let's talk about how you will actually do the self-examination. First of all, when I mentioned that you will use your fingers flat, and then do the examination. How does it look like? You can do it in two ways. One, either you press your fingers gentle on your breast like this, back and forth, as I will show you in a minute. Or you can also use your fingers like this and check for any kind of bumps and thickening like this, okay? gently press like that or as I said in this motion either way so when I mention in step one and step three you will do the breast self-examination with your fingers flat it actually looks like this first you go on your breast start from the outside of your breast up and down up and down up and down as I said you can also press up down up down up down Okay, we do this on the right side and on your left side. Then we will do in a shape that goes inside towards your breast and then outside. And then outside, inside, outside, inside, outside, inside, outside, inside, outside, inside, outside, inside, outside, inside. Okay? So, as I said, you can also do gently pressing with your fingers flat, like 
that. Okay? Now, the third one is you will check your breasts, again, both rest side and left side, from the outside of your breast clockwise in a circular motion towards the inside of your breasts. In a circular motion all the way towards the nipple and then you can do the same thing with your fingers that either or again in all of these three you need to do all three not one you need to do all three of them on each breast again we will look for any bumps or thickening and then finally you will press gently squeeze gently the nipple between your thumb and your index finger for any kind of discharges any kind of clear or bloody discharge from your nipple has to be immediately reported to your doctor don't forget that that is very important And then finally, after we are done with our breast self-examination, we will have to check our armpits. The reason for that is under our armpits, there are lymph nodes. And those are very important to check as well in your breast self-examination. So what we're going to do is we will rest our arm or any kind of bookshelf or chair. And then we will check again, fingers flat or armpit for any kind of thickening, bumps, all right? And we'll do the exact same thing with the right side. So, that's it for today. I hope this was helpful. If you like this video and find it helpful, please click like and then share with your friends. It's very important that you share this with your friends and family so that they can actually do this and maybe you will be the person who help save their lives. So we would like to hear from you if you do your monthly breast self-examination and how did that help you. And if you'd like to donate to our cancer nonprofit organization so that we can actually provide you with these free cancer videos, then please consider donating at cancer@institute.org slash donate. We would so appreciate your donations and thank you in advance. So thanks again for watching and we will be seeing you in the next episode. Take care. So we hope this was helpful to you. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more cancer videos. And once you subscribe, don't forget to hit the bell so that you can be informed when we publish our new video. Thanks again for watching and we will see you in the next episode. Take care.